In the beginning, the world did not know cards. That is, until the day the scribes arrived. Each had their own method of inscription to create cards. Grimora used her quill to inscribe the epitaphs of the dead. Leshy used the wildlife camera to capture beasts. PO3 used a particle scanner to copy the CPUs of robots. And Magnificus used his brush to paint his wizard pupils. With the cards created, the scribes had solidified their power until one day, a challenger arrived to replace one of the scribes. Choose a starting deck to mark your ambition. I don't know what they do. Um, I'm gonna pick the robot. Yeah. The cards were added to your collection. Okay. What the fuck? So this is all their worlds. So I'm assuming the this area is Grimora, because it's got R.I.P. here, like in a mausoleum and tombstones. And I'm assuming this is Leshy's area, because it's like a forest and a cabin and stuff. Technology for the, the robot guy, I forgot his name. And wizard guy. That's fucking weird. Hey, how's it going? Woof. I was just about to call it quits out here. But now that there's a challenger in our midst, it's back to work for me. I should be able to get this bridge fixed in, uh... Full disclosure, it'll take me exactly as long as it takes you to defeat one of those scribes. So, uh, come back later. Wait a minute, so were those other cards? The other three cards, were those the other people? Because the stoat looked like a machine. The wolf looked kind of like a wizard. So then was the stink bug Grimora? Yep, see, like that. That's that's what Grimora looked like, kind of. Or I mean, that's what the stink bug looked like. Yo, hey, marvelous. I am Grimora, scribe of the dead. Until quite recently, I was disgraced. Though I was returned to my former glory with the help of some unlikely friends. If you wish to test your skills against me, you must first prove your wits. You must discern which tomb marks the final resting place of my lovely ghouls. You found a piece of an epitaph. It reads, Eaten by a hungry dog. Okay. You found a piece of an epitaph. It reads, does not hold a grudge. Hmm. Interesting. Wait, what? Does not hold a grudge. Eating that hungry dog. Okay, so I haven't found all three yet. Okay. Oh no! Oh no! Do not look upon me! Do not snarl or sniff, I beg you. If you wish to battle, please, let us get it over with. Oh, something's wrong. It's your deck. Oh, rather your lack of a valid one. You've got 20 cards in it, right? What the fuck is going on? Leapbot. Leapbot will block an opposing creature bearing the airborne sigil. 49er. At the end of the owner's... I don't know, I'm still using that voice. At the end of the owner's turn, 49er will move in the direction inscribed in the sigil. Automation. Thick droid. Steambot. Um, I don't even 
even. What? I don't know what I'm doing. I'm just clicking on shit. Uh, sure. Yeah? Uh, okay. Um, alright. That looks much better. Wait, wait, wait. I don't fucking know. I don't know where we were, my guy. Yeah, you were the stout. You silly bitch. Yep, I'm PO3, okay? You picked my starter deck. That means you have to learn to use energy. Do I really have to explain this to you? Yeah, yeah that's definitely the stout. Stout was such a prick. At the start of each turn, you increase your max energy. Spend it or not, doesn't matter. At the start of your turn, your energy refills to the max. Get it? Uh, not really. Um, so I can only really lay down that one. See that? You spent your energy to play the card. But you get it back next turn. Sick of hearing from me? Well, I'm sick of talking. I've got important work to do. I got robo shit to do. You'll see me later. Alright. Alright, alright. Um, well, I still only have one, so I can't really do anything else. So, uh, yeah. Attacking Revenant Parishes. Oh, okay. So this guy's kind of like a kamikaze card. Okay. Alright, so let's whip out a tank. Yeah? 49er moves to a new space. Revenant collapses into a pile of bones. Cool. Now I got three energy. Okay, and they just automatically give me a card. Okay, so this is I like how they keep it pretty much the same as far as like the health versus uh, defense thing, but also Something I mean this is the only card I can play so th I have to lose it looks like Skeleton collapses into a pile of bones. So the skeleton's pretty much the same thing as the revenant thing. Okay, got it. Got it. Yeah! Now I can pull out the thick boy. Or whatever the fuck this thing's called. Um. Yeah, you go there. I probably should have waited to see where his next card was gonna be before, before doing that. It's not very wise on my part. Skeleton collapses into a pile of bones. Alright. And then, uh, get another one of these, uh, sick guys out there. And, uh, just for good measure, let's uh, get that guy out there. And, uh, have a nice day. Alright. Uh, okay, so this was really just pretty much a tutorial type thing. Oh, that's cool. He, he turns on his light. Yeah. Well, I mean, I don't have any spaces, really. So, uh, yeah. Excess damage. I get two of... What the fuck? It is over. You shoot me out. Now, please, look away. Turn your eyes to this card pack instead. We received a deathly card pack. Neato. I am called Sawyer. The middle stone marks my grave. Please, do not go digging up my bones. You found a piece of an epitaph. It reads, Soya, Patel 1702, Fall 1778. Okay, so he was an old dude when he died. Wait, what am I supposed to do again? Hello. And again, uh, this lady was uh, a stink bug in the, the last place. Hey. They eaten by a hungry dog. Sawyer? Yep. That's... Yeah, because he is the middle one. Who are you? Oh, okay, so I'm assuming I have to battle these skeletons and then put their epitaphs in the right spot. Okay, that's... 
a thing. Okay. Hark. A living slice of lemon approaches. Bright and shrig as a lime. You think you would squeeze a defeat out of me? Sure. Ghost ship. Water bone. Also, at the end of the owner's turn, ghost ship will move into the direction inscribed in the sigil and drop a skeleton in its old place. Space. Okay. Oakley dokley. Alright, so again, I can only use this thing. That thing's gonna die, so it doesn't really matter. Okay. Skeleton collapses into a pile of bones. Okay. Ghost ship moves to a new space. And a skeleton jump ship. Okay. 49er moves to a new space. Ghost ship emerges from the deep. Skeleton collapses into a pile of bones. Ghost ship moves to a new space and a skeleton jump ship. Got it. Okay, I don't want to waste energy on the automaton because it doesn't fucking do anything. So I'm gonna. S or wait, no. I keep forgetting that's slightly different. Okay, so it will automatically restore. So. Um, yeah. Good ship emerges from the deep. Skeleton collection is into a pile of bones. Go ship, blah blah, skeleton. Get you out there, I guess. Uh. Skeleton collapses to a pile of bones. Go ship, yeah. We know what you're doing. Ghost ship emerges from the deep. Let's get them. Yeah, now I can get out Steamboat Willie. Yeah. What do you think about that? Didn't expect that, did you? Ha! Gotcha. Aye. You beat the pulp out of me. Firstly, Take you this. You received the Deathly Card Pack. And because you bested me with you, I'll share my secret. <coughs> my name's Royal. It's the far right tomb. Here's the headpiece. You found a piece of an epitaph. Okay. It reads Royal Dominguez. 1589, spring 1632. Okay. Okay. Yeah. Like I said, my name's Royal. It's the far right tomb. Yar, life didn't give me lemons, so I died. Oh, so did he like die of scurvy? Wait, no, that's that's from oranges. So, what are you? What's the thing with? Doesn't make sense, dude. Doesn't make sense. Royal. Okay. By hungry dog, he was not. Does not hold a grudge. I don't really know. No, that, I don't think that applies to him. Because he got an obsession with lemons. So if I see something that says obsessed with lemons, I know that's him. Yeah, yeah, I already talked to you, dude. Oh, wait. Wonder if he has more to say now. I am called Sawyer. The middle stone marks my grave. Do not sniff or snarl. Hmm, okay. Was he eaten by a dog, maybe? Because I know that I have a thing that says something about dogs or some shit. <laughs> Did someone leave the AC on? Oh, I thought that he was, like, growling at me. He was, like, saying cold. Anyway. Oh, come on, dude. It's freezing in here. 
maybe a heated battle will help. All right, so now I can only really use this thing, which does no damage, just does defense. So, uh, yeah, okay, fair enough, fair enough. Um, and then how about, oh, you, you stay there. Um, oh, actually that worked out. I didn't even notice he had the flying thing. Uh, yeah, the drower. Dr you know, I've seen that word a lot. I have never heard anyone actually say it, so I have no idea if I'm saying that correctly. Skeletons just commit suicide. Um, which, you know, that's, that's a fair response. Okay, so you go there so you can still block that guy, and you go there to block the spooky skeleton. 49er moves to a new space. Okay. Skeleton collapses into a pile of bones. Ooh, what's this guy? Oh, okay, this is just the same thing. Okay, so it's the damage that's different from the regular spooky skeleton. Okay, gotcha, gotcha. Important things to know. You go there, just because, you know, why not? 49er moves. Coming and collapses into a pile of bones. Okay. So you go there, and uh, yeah, driver releases creature inside. Yeah, yeah, see, yeah. 49er moves. Skeleton collapses into a pile of bones. Yeah, just whip out with Steamboat Willy. 49er moves. Okay. Revenant goes split. And then uh, you, you uh, go there, I guess. Yeah, foils gained, yeah. I'm assuming those are card packs. You won, but now I'm a bit less cold. Take a pack on the house. You received a deathly card pack. You did beat me, so I guess I've got to fess up. The name's Casey, Casey Hobbs. I'm from the tombstone on the left. You found a piece of an epitaph. Casey Hobbs, 1970 to winter 1992. Probably froze to death, I'm assuming. Okay. He wasn't eaten by a dog. Not much. I'm gonna guess that this guy was eaten by a dog. Because this guy wasn't, and this guy wasn't. So, using my, my noodle, and this guy said something about don't sniff and snarl. Uh, okay. And I think he was the middle one, if I'm not mistaken. Yeah, final answer. I mean, they didn't ask if that was my final answer, but that's, 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 that's what I'm going with. All right. Uh, I guess there's uh, more to the mystery this away. What? No, no, come on, get, get back in there. Got a, got a mystery to solve here, like Scooby-Doo. Can I walk past? Oh, I can, I'm so stupid. I, they're ghosts, you can just walk through ghosts. Duh. You pulled up an epitaph piece. It reads, the defibrillator failed. Ooh. Okay, so you have to like use it like a puzzle. Okay, okay. So, but he, I'm assuming, froze to death. Oh, yeah, I could, I forgot I can probably go through there, but that's okay. You found a piece of an epitaph in the casket, among other things. It reads, hit by a falling piece of ice. Okay, so that's, that's that guy. Because I thought he froze to death, but okay, that makes sense. Ooh, spooky. You found a piece of an epitaph. It reads, there was no cure. There was no cure. Hmm. Okay, so I have to unlock the epitaphs in order to talk to her, probably. Okay, gotcha, gotcha, gotcha. You found a piece of an epitaph. It reads, brought down by scurvy. <laughs> I knew it. Okay, but hungry dog. Uh, there was no cure. Does not hold a grudge is probably, yeah, okay. And you have uncurable scurvy. Brought down by scurvy. Okay, there was no cure. Yeah, yeah. okay. So you would have to be, because you're the cold dude, and the defibrillator failed, right? Yeah! Marvelous! I believe you have proven your wits adequately. Are you prepared? You will not defeat me. Uh, okay. Marvelous. Just marvelous. I was beginning to worry I would be sealed behind those tombstones forever. Locked down at the mercy of a challenger's wits until one day discovered. But no, you prevailed, and now it's time to build. But I just freed you, and you want to fight me? What the fuck? 